Good afternoon, Small World Cappers. It's Mrs. Everhart again, and I'm here to do a little craft that's called funnel painting, and it's to sort of tie in the lesson you guys had with Mrs. Stein having to do with stalagmites and stalactites and gravity. So, I sent a picture in my email of the supplies that you'll need, but I'm going to go over that with you right now. So you're going to need some white paper, Preferably cardstock, it's just a little bit heavier. If you happen to have that, that'd be great. If not, any white paper will do. If you happen to have paints at home, this is really the craft for painting. It is funnel painting. It doesn't really work with crayons or watercolors. So I apologize for that. Perhaps you guys have some paints at home. Also a funnel through which the paint will drip onto the paper. If you don't happen to have a funnel, I've kind of made up my own little funnel and that's a styrofoam or a a cough, like a, a cup and you would just punch some holes in it so that the paint can drizzle through and you're just going to move it over your paper. So I'm going to do it two ways. I'm going to do some using this and some using this. Okay. All right. All right. The first color. Does anybody have a suggestion as to what color we should start with? I have pink, I have yellow, and I have green, and I have purple. What did I hear? I heard some pink. So yeah, I, I'm fine with going in with pink. So let's shake it up and let's try it in our funnel. So we're gonna, we're gonna take our paint, we're gonna pour it in our funnel and we're just gonna drizzle it over the paper. So it comes out sort of in globs, okay? All right, so I'm gonna take my funnel, I'm gonna put it in the sink because I have to wash it between applications. So boys and girls, this is how it comes out when you're working with your funnel. So you're gonna take your uh, finger or you can take a butter knife and you're just gonna kind of wiggle it through the paint. So if you bake and they ask you to uh, put two ingredients inside the pan, sometimes they ask you to take your butter knife and make a swirl. So that's what we're gonna do with our butter knife here. We're gonna take it, we're gonna go through, and we're just gonna swirl it around, okay? Just gonna swirl it around. Okay, the next thing we're gonna do is we're gonna take a different color, let's say perhaps this bright green, and we're gonna put it in our styrofoam bowl and we're going to see what happens when the paint comes through it. Well, it's drizzling through right now. It's coming through in a glob that I'm not really sure. What's up with that? Shake it around. And I'll show you how it came, came onto my paper. It came onto my paper also in globs, so I'm going to take my butter knife and I'm going to swirl it all around. Can you see me swirl? It's sort of like what we did, same kind of method as to what we did with the shaving cream. Some of the colors blend. Okay, let's think of another color. Let's try some yellow. All right, I'm going to hit, I'm going to go over and rinse my funnel. Be right back. Boys and girls, I rinsed my funnel and now I'm ready for the yellow paint. Put it through. Ooh, it drizzles right through there. Okay, that came through very, very quickly. That must be a different consistency. I'm going to take my butter knife and I'm going to swirl it around. Ooh, I see some colors down here blending. And my last Example, I'm gonna rinse this. I'll be right back. I'm gonna rinse it so we can use some of our purple. I'll be right back. Okay, boys and girls, I'm ready to put my yellow in here. Or, pardon me, my, my purple. Pouring it over my paper. Let's see what happens to the paint when I do that. Oh, I, got, I shake it. 
when I shake it, oh, that's the best. It came out the best when you shook it. So I want to tell you, boys and girls, that I think, there you go. There's your funnel painting, but actually, I think I'm going to I'm going to modify it and make it your styrofoam bowl painting. Have fun creating, cappers. See you soon. Send me a picture of your creation. Bye-bye.